Luke and Nate here at the Outdoor Boys YouTube channel and we're going to find out whether you can make one of these super polished aluminum foil balls by simply sticking tin foil in a microwave. Well last week we had a great time making some videos where we took balls of aluminum foil and compressed them and polished them till they absolutely shined. Kind of pointless, but it was actually kind of fun. We had a great time doing that with uh, me and the boys. And we got a lot of awesome comments from people. And one of the most common comments we got was people encouraging me to put it in a microwave. They said that if you take a ball of aluminum foil and microwave it for three to five minutes, it'll turn into this. And you don't need to spend all that time hammering and polishing and, and all that stuff. And I did a little searching around. It turns out people are saying this because there's a video out there where some guy says he can do that ju just that. And he puts a ball of aluminum foil in, hits it for a few minutes, and out pops a perfectly polished sphere of aluminum. So we're gonna find out what happens when you put a ball of aluminum foil in the microwave and whether or not you can polish aluminum by heating it up. Hey Becca, can I put an aluminum ball in the microwave? No. Can no. I light it on fire? No. Can I melt aluminum foil in the microwave? No. How about now? Okay. Hey. Yeah, microwave. For those of you who do not know, putting aluminum foil in a microwave can be exciting. So let me just put this little tiny bit in there just to give you a flavor for what to expect. Let's check it out. You know, it's cool to the touch. It's not even warm. So this right here is an entire roll of aluminum foil that's been compressed into a ball. We're gonna put it in here and see what happens. Now, some people have left comments that if we put it in the microwave for three to five minutes, it'll make it really perfectly smooth and uh, make it all glossy. We're gonna find out what happens. We're gonna put it in for about five minutes and just find out. Well, this is disappointing. It's not popping or exploding or lighting on fire or anything. It's actually more dramatic with just a little tiny piece of aluminum than with the whole big ball. But uh, who knows, it still might polish it, might melt it down and make it easier to to, to polish it, we'll, we'll find out. I'm gonna let it go the full five minutes. All right, let's check this out. It's just a little bit warm. That's it. Didn't do anything. That was epically disappointing. Well guys, you came here to see sparks and fireworks and crazy microwave stuff, so. We gotta put more tin foil in the microwave, don't we? Yeah. Yeah, let's do this thing. Yeah! We're gonna make something happen here. All right. Right. Oh. That did. oh, that did burn a little bit back there. That melted the plastic and burned a little hole back there. Oh, a little bit here too. Huh. Well, apparently loose aluminum foil does, makes the oven go crazy, but compacted, compressed aluminum foil does not. So I'm gonna try something crazy. Just put a loose ball of aluminum foil in there and see what happens. Let's 
see what we got. Barely even warm. There's a little hole right there. A little, little hole right there, a little hole right there. But, yeah, didn't really do much of anything. Just put a few holes in it, made it slightly warm. Made some sparks. Disappointing. Yeah. Here. See that in the back? Oh. Black, do I owe you a new microwave, babe? Yes. <laughs> oh my God. I thought as much. <laughs> yeah, look at that. It burned, it burned the microwave. Did the bird was in the microwave? A real plant burned in the microwave? No, not a bird in the microwave. A burn in the microwave. <laughs> That was fun, but I think it's pretty clear you cannot create a super polished ball of aluminum simply by sticking some tin foil in the microwave. I think somebody was pulling a little uh, uh, prank on the internet with that uh, video. Additionally, I got a load of comments from my, my mates across the pond. Yeah, baby! <laughs> informing me that I was spelling aluminium incorrectly. Um, there are two correct spellings for aluminum or aluminium, depending on what type of English you like to speak. Uh, British English, it's aluminium with an extra I. And here in the great US of A, in America, we say aluminum. USA, 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 USA. Thanks for watching. We hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see more great videos from the Outdoor Boys YouTube channel, don't forget to click subscribe. We put out new videos every week. And don't forget to hit that bell button so you'll get notified when we put out another great video.